So we have talked about Monte job fracture in the previous video. Now Gigliazzi is kind of the opposite because Gigliazzi is a fracture in the distal one third of the radius and dislocation of the distal radio ulnar joint. Gigliazzi, an Italian name, is a fracture of the distal one third of the radius with dislocation of the distal radio ulnar joint due to fallen outstretched arm in a hyperpronation manner. Okay, how to manage it? First, we diagnose by x-ray, as you know. Management-wise, do a neurovascular exam, especially the anterior interosseous nerve. Now, it's difficult to diagnose anterior interosseous nerve problems because this is not a sensory nerve. It's a purely motor branch of the median nerve. Why is that difficult? Usually, sensory nerves are easier to diagnose by the pin brick sensation test However, motor nerves can take a while. This nerve supplies both the flexor pollicis longus as well as the flexor digitorum profundus. Okay, loss of these muscle functions will lead to weakness in the pinch mechanism between your thumb and your index fingers when you're trying to grab something by these two fingers. Management, children, conservative by closed reduction, adults open reduction internal fixation in the operating room. We call Gigliazzi fracture a fracture of necessity because it necessitates open reduction internal fixation. That's it for today. In the next video, we'll compare between Montegia fracture and Gigliazzi fracture. Both of them are Italian names. So please consider subscribing to get the next video. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, as well as SoundCloud where I post audio notes for your test. See you!